a protester accused of throwing eggs at the king and queen consort earlier this week launched a second crowdfunding page to raise money for his legal bills, after he claims his first GoFundMe page was removed. Patrick Thelwell, 23, was detained by police on suspicion of a public order offence after the monarch travelled to York for the unveiling of a statue dedicated to his mother, the late Queen Elizabeth II. King Charles was speaking to crowds at Micklegate Bar, the historic entrance to the city of York, when footage showed eggs passing close to the monarch. A shout attributed to the person responsible for throwing eggs was heard saying, this country was built on the blood of slaves. None of the four eggs thrown in the direction of the king and queen consort landed on the royals. Police officers were then captured restraining Thelwell and removing him from the scene. North Yorkshire police said Thelwell had been interviewed and subsequently released on bail. But Thelwell, a climate activist and University of York student, called for public donations through a GoFundMe page which was swiftly removed. Posting a new link on his private Instagram account, Thelwell said the original crowdfunding page was set up by my friends and was taken down this morning. It is thought he managed to reach just under £200 in donations before the page was taken down. The new page reiterated that Thelwell faces up to six months in prison and a £5,000 fine. It has currently raised just £3 towards its £20,000 target. Chants of God Save the King could be heard in footage recorded following the incident. Speaking after his arrest. Telwell said he heard the crowd literally screaming and wailing with pure rage as the royals were quickly moved away. Telwell told the mirror, people were ripping chunks of my hair out, they were spitting at me. People lost their minds. It's just so revealing to see when you challenge someone's beliefs in that way, the belief of the superiority of this man's blood. The master's degree student claimed he had received death threats since Wednesday through social media. Thelwell said he did what I did because I don't believe in kings, adding he felt he needed to voice a protest against the state of this country and the descent into fascism. Describing his bail conditions as amusing, he claimed he was not allowed to be within 500 meters of the sovereign. He said a special alteration had been made to his ban on carrying eggs in public to allow him to carry groceries. He is expected to appear in court in early December after being charged with a Section 4 public order offence.